Okay, let me explain to you why this makes a lot of sense for this Jimmy turning on Jey Uso. Like, you want to build a storyline. You want to build something to WrestleMania. And the Usos, they don't have nothing to prove as tag team at this point. They need to establish more as a singles. And SmackDown just wants to continue the Bloodline storyline. So you might you might want to continue the next chapter. So I think that makes sense. I don't think you want to have Jey Uso beating Roman Reigns and taking the title. That would really kind of damage Roman Reigns' reputation. But what makes the most sense as a fan of wrestling is that you can build the storyline like we've seen this happen like here's some hints when jay uso kind of said that jimmy's out of the bloodline did jimmy really say that think about it think about it he didn't even say a word and then jay kind of concluded himself out too so he kind of included his brother in the mix and then there was a lot of this left out story uh, line. Like Jimmy was just kind of like the forgotten guy. And he's kind of tired of being under the shadow. So you kind of think this would be a great storyline. Have a jealousy sibling rivalry. Like we haven't seen this type of event like this since the Bella Twins. Remember how Nikki turned on Brie at SummerSlam? That kind of gave you a hint of what was going to happen. But what can really happen is the Usos can establish himself as singles and jay can is building on jay's actually building some huge momentum even without winning the title he's actually getting over people jimmy just needs to start becoming the singles and he needs to have a spot at the main event too so jimmy needs to build himself so he has to betray his brother he has to be the jealous brother because in order for this to be a great storyline uh, jimmy was pretty much the forgotten guy and he wants to prove that he is more better than his other brother and this is a great dramatic storyline this is a match they've been wanting for WrestleMania, and this can go on until WrestleMania. So you might want to see this. It makes sense, because you want to invest and see Jay beat the crap out of his brother who betrayed him. You want to see Jay be the hero, right? But then you want to see Jimmy get his butt whipped. That's what's interesting, because Jimmy was just jealous and was left out of the picture, you know what I mean?